Thanks for taking a look at Google for your data cloud needs. This quick video will demonstrate what organizations can achieve when they tap into Google Data Cloud's limitless capabilities across all data, workloads, and users. Lisa is a data analyst at Symbol Direct, a fashion retailer that manages its own logistics across multiple regional distribution centers. The company recently experienced a spike in fleet management costs due to an increase in gas consumption and various other inefficiencies. To get to the bottom of this, Lisa knows that she will need to quickly and securely combine internal data and external data, analyze data across multiple clouds, and most importantly, work with data without experiencing limits across size, scale, and format. Finally, Lisa will need to tap into machine learning to model future trends and present her analyses in a way that business users can understand and act on quickly. What's great about Google's Data Cloud is that it provides a fully interoperable and limitless data ecosystem that allows Lisa to innovate and solve problems faster. For instance, Google's Data Cloud comes with free, embedded, and real-time business intelligence capabilities that let Lisa quickly get an overview of her business. She notices an unusual spike in recent delivery times and distances, which is resulting in an increase in gas usage across the fleet. Let's dig into this a bit more. BigQuery is the serverless analytics powerhouse at the core of the Limitless Data Cloud and is built with elasticity, flexibility, security, and reliability in mind. Lisa can analyze data of any size or type without a lot of operational overhead, and she doesn't have to worry about running out of capacity because the data cloud scales to meet her needs. Lisa can query across clouds, and with integrated data sharing, she can easily and securely access data from other teams and organizations without having to make copies. This is the BigQuery UI. On the left, you can see the data sets Lisa has access to. She can start working with them immediately. She doesn't have to set up a virtual warehouse, pick a size, or do any of the administrative management of the warehouse. That's because the Google Data Cloud scales horizontally and vertically to the needs of the organization and is fully managed. With free data ingestion and on-demand consumption-based pricing, Lisa only pays for the queries she runs. Speaking of scale, whatever your data set size, the Google Data Cloud can handle it. Lisa first starts her investigation with a data set that contains historical order data. She wants to make sure there are no significant changes in orders, even though there have been some outliers recently in delivery times. This table contains over one petabyte of data, a trillion rows of transactions. It's a real-world data set, scrubbed and partitioned by day and clustered by customer for performance. Joining tables at scale is no problem for BigQuery. Let's look at this query, Average Daily Sales, joined against the product table. A trillion rows, about 10 seconds. No manual cluster resizing, no waiting for a warehouse to be provisioned. The order data looks good, so Lisa is going to dig further into delivery data to see what's going on. In her dashboard, Lisa saw a spike in delivery times and mileage. The query that backs the dashboard compares delivery stats over the last hour to the most recent five-day window. Delivery data is ingested in real time through built-in streaming support. Lisa can process real-time data without having to set up additional products, tools, or infrastructure. That's not something offered with other cloud data warehouses. Google's Limitless Data Cloud is not limited to structured data. Lisa can query against unstructured and semi-structured data across the data cloud directly from within BigQuery. For example, some of the product delivery data is in JSON, stored in Google Cloud Storage. Within BigQuery, Lisa can explore the data directly. She can even query against it, seeing results in tabular or JSON format as well. Lisa's theory is that the delivery time spike may be due to inventory issues at certain distribution centers. So next, she's going to look at incoming wholesale orders. Even though that data is managed by another team, it's fast and easy for Lisa to get access to what she needs. Integrated data sharing functionality means Lisa can get access to internal data, public data sets, commercial data sets from Google partners, and Google exclusive data sets, such as search trends, all in one place. It's a frictionless experience for analyzing data across Google's open ecosystem. The purchasing team has set up a private exchange, enabling anyone in the company to access the data via a read-only linked data set. This means Lisa can access what she needs without making copies or moving data around. The purchasing team has published metadata about the data set, so Lisa knows it's the right one, 
and she can add it to her project to start querying it. Now Lisa returns to the SQL workspace. Her shared dataset has already been added to her project and it's ready to use right away. This dataset has wholesale order data, but she needs to know a little more about one of these columns, and the source for that is actually on AWS. An external data source is set up here, which lets Lisa use the Data Cloud's integrated cross-cloud analytics to query data in Amazon S3, all within the same SQL workspace. Lisa can look up all distribution centers quickly. She doesn't have to copy any data over in order to query this data set in S3 and she only pays egress on the result of the query, not the full data set. This means full interoperability across clouds with lower data egress costs than with other data warehouses. This single pane of glass to manage and analyze data is great for organizations that use AWS or Azure for their application stack, but centralize their analytics on Google Cloud. For example, application log data on AWS can easily be queried from within Google's data cloud, and cross-cloud data transfer makes it simple to copy over result sets for anomaly detection or other log analytics. Lisa and her team can also directly ingest data from Teradata or Redshift, or even event-level data from Google's ads products. Google's data cloud also integrates easily with ecosystem data integration partners like Fivetran and Informatica. Security is easy to manage across the Google Data Cloud. With fine-grained access controls at the table, row, and column level, and dynamic data masking, Lisa only sees data necessary for her job. For example, Lisa doesn't have the required access to view all user information. Symbol Direct enforces data governance through a centralized data catalog and can ensure data security and privacy controls. These policy tags are set in the main data catalog and enforced in BigQuery but Lisa can still access aggregate information about the number of customers in each city. All of Google Data Cloud's advanced security features are offered at no additional charge for all customers across the data cloud. Lisa now has all of her data sources identified and looks at the inventory status by distribution center, and it's clear there's a stock issue. She contacts the purchasing team with her findings and they make adjustments to their ordering schedule. But Lisa also doesn't want the increase in delivery times to affect customer retention. Using Google Data Cloud's integrated machine learning, Lisa can generate predictive analytics using familiar SQL syntax. Lisa creates a churn prediction model that predicts the set of customers who are retention risks, which the customer service and marketing teams can use for outreach and targeted offers. All of these insights are available from predefined machine learning models without having to copy datasets over to a separate exploration tool. It's all right here, on the fly, integrated into the data cloud and accessible to any analyst who can write SQL. If Lisa wants to share this model with her data science team directly, she can do so easily using Vertex AI, Google's native AI workbench, including integration into Vertex ML Ops framework. She can also use any of Google's ecosystem partner solutions from C3 AI to Data IQ to Data Robot. That way, Lisa's data science colleagues will be able to use the notebooks they're most familiar with. They can even use PySpark directly from within the SQL workspace. Google Cloud is committed to meeting users where they are and making it easy for teams to get access to the data they need, when they need it, using the tools most familiar to them. Speaking of tools people are most familiar with, do your users like spreadsheets? Well, remember the query Lisa ran earlier? Its result set can of course be visualized in Google's built-in business intelligence tool or partner tools like Tableau or Power BI, but it can also be explored directly in Google Sheets in just a few clicks. This is something Lisa's finance colleagues are bound to like. No other data cloud can provide such a set of limitless capabilities for all data, all workloads, and all users. We hope you enjoyed this quick tour. To get started today without a credit card, get access to the Google BigQuery Sandbox by clicking the link below.